Well, Wave Warrior, son of Act of War, bred by Summerhill Stud. Uh, well done to Twilight Moon Equine. Uh, of course, the Wenzels, Roy and Rose. Congratulations to you. Your colors are in the number one box here, and he's now a three-time winner. Uh, Atandiwem Kutla and Alison Wright. And Sipa Mandla is a gentleman, all smiles. What a surprise today, Sipa Mandla. 2,000 Rand. Well done to you. Well done. Congratulations, Hollywood Bets and Gold Circle. It's the change of the order from 1,000 to 2,000 today. Sipa Mandla, congratulations to you. Well done to the winning groom. He's done an outstanding job here. And Atantiwe uh, Imkutla, what a ride. Ooh. I know that you were the biggest outsider. You wouldn't have known this, but you were the biggest outsider on the tote. But as I was watching the race and the way you were traveling so sweetly, I said it's going to take a good one to pass you by. And uh, for those that went for you at a big price, well played. But for those that didn't, uh, hard luck because Tandy has rode a, a, an excellent race here from the front. Well played. Thank you very much, Diz. Um, I really do appreciate that. Yeah, it's days like this that uh, make it worthwhile. So, yeah, I'm grateful. That was always your plan? You had the draw, you were never going to waste it? Yes, you know, um, the past couple of starts I've ridden them, um, you can feel it's a type of horse that uh, enjoys to use his action. And unfortunately, in his last couple of starts, he hasn't really been allowed to do so. But today, everything was always going to fall into play. Um, there wasn't much speed in the race, so he had it all easy. He was comfortable in front, and I knew once I was going at that tempo that it was going to take a good one to beat him today. You started off as a young apprentice, and uh, we are going to refresh that memory uh, when you had your jackpot, you used to ride for Allison and, and Kevin, and then you had that lull, that period where you made decisions in your career. But you're back with them now, because I've just had a chat with Kevin, and he says he's very happy having you back in the yard. Yes, yeah, it's, it's fantastic. You know, um, from very early days when I was young, they gave me the opportunity. So obviously the, uh, the liking was always there. And um, yeah, it's just really nice uh, once again to be not only riding for them, but uh, to be standing here, you know, uh, being rewarded. I'm forever grateful, honestly. And you're getting to know the horses. That's a big positive. You get to know the horses back home, you ride them at the races. Yes, yeah, you know, I think, uh, I think that's the winning move, you know. Um, we take it very lightly, but I think uh, the, the winning is from back home, you know, when you get to know them. When you come in here, I think um, everything is already done. And, yeah, it's very important that you're there in the mornings. And uh, I'm privileged enough to be able to ride work in the morning. And like you just said, you know, I get to know the horses. And, uh, yeah, it's awesome to be standing here. I'm really grateful. Pink's not for me. I'm more a blue boy. But it looks good on you, these pink colors. Does it? Yeah, it does. <laughs> All right. No, thank you. <laughs> thank you. This, well yeah. done to Roy and Rose. Yes, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, well done to them. Obviously, I think it took a lot of patience, but uh, nice that is coming on today. And uh, yeah, to uh, Sporting Post, my sponsors, Mr. and Mrs. Wright, appreciate their help. Thank you. Good ride. Thank you. Alison has been waiting patiently. Firstly, you know, uh, when it comes to jockeys, we, we know that with the Hollywood Syndicate, that the first choice or entry is uh, Richard Furee. But really nice to have Tandy in the yard now. No, absolutely. And he's working really hard, Dees. So, and it's nice to have that feedback every morning. So, yeah, very happy and big well done to him. Nice ride. But I must say a huge congratulations to Roy and Rose. And um, thanks for all the support. Um, our owners will have seen that they've invested into the yard in a big way. And um, we've um, put in a whole rehab centre. We've got ice machines, nebulizers beamers, all sorts of um, rehab um, machinery, and um, it's all thanks to them, and uh, we are benefiting hugely from that. Well, that's fantastic, because it's all about keeping up with the times and using technology to enhance the chances of your horse. So for them to have invested in you and your yard with all this, this equipment, it, it must be wonderful. No, absolutely, and we're very grateful, and like I say, our owners will benefit from it. And um, I must also say a huge thank you to Tess Zietzman, um, she's working in the yard now and for Ro Roy and Rose and she does all that rehab for us and um, she's worked really hard on this horse so to see him win today is just fantastic. Well it's having the edge, that's what it's about, trying to have the edge on uh, your competition and I'm sure that's going to go a long way. You spoke about the investment with the technology, what about the investment with the horses? You got a lot of young horses for them that will be coming through? Yeah, Dees, they've uh, bred a, a number of babies that we've got in the yard, a nice bunch of babies, and yeah, they'll have fun. 
Well, they've had a lot of success in the past. Who can forget? I mean, uh, they've had a lot of war of Athena. Is obviously their special horse, but they're a big investment in the game. And please give them our best. No, absolutely. And uh, yeah, like I say, just a big well done to them. And thank you for all the help and support. Well, it's Roy and Rose, so big smile for them. Yeah, absolutely. And uh, well done to our sponsors, Hollywood Bets, and to Summerhill who bred them. Before you leave, you, you got anything at the back? Um, these we've got uh, two runners, um, Ultra Quick, and who else have we got? Um, yeah, he's uh, hoping for a better run from him. Uh, just, we've got some pacifiers on him today, and uh, hopefully these conditions will suit him. What well, do you want Tess to say a few words on behalf yeah. of the owners? Yeah. Uh, she doesn't want. Tess, come through. Come just have a, a quick word. Uh, glad to have you part of the team, as Alison mentioned. Uh, you know, working behind the scenes uh, with. Uh, everything in trying to get the horses to full fitness and it must be an exciting job because I know that you love horses and you've always been around them being the daughter of Gary Rich uh, but how's this new profile that you've been given? Amazing I'm just so grateful for the opportunity Roy and Rose are lovely people and um, they do everything for their horses so we're very very grateful thank you. This horse a lot of work has been done? He came uh, yeah he's he's a handful but he's Perfect. They always look good here. Well, Tess, give them our best, you know, for the investment in the stable, the technology, etc. And I wish them all the best with their horses moving forward. And with your new job, uh, with the rights, I wish you all the best. Thank you so much. I'd just like to say a big well done and thank you to G Racing and the team at home. Well done, Tess. Thank you. Congratulations to everybody concerned. Yeah. And uh, that was uh, some good news for the stable of Alison Wright. A huge injection of investment when it comes to technology and horse flesh because they've got some young horses that we'll be waiting to see come to the racetrack. But race number five belongs to horse number two, Wave Warrior.